HPV stands for human papillomavirus. Uh, it's a very common virus. There's about 50 or more different varieties of HPV. Uh, most of them uh, lead to things like warts on the skin and are uh, fairly uh, relatively harmless, not life-threatening types of problems. Unfortunately, um, the HPV-16 variety has been a rising source of head and neck cancer, particularly cancers of the tonsil uh, and the tongue base. Uh, the, the virus tends to uh, like to harbor the lymphoid tissue of the tonsils and the tongue base. Uh, it is a sexually transmitted disease, it's an STD. So um, uh, studies have shown that uh, if you have multiple sex partners, uh, your risks are higher, um, uh, something upwards of 20 times uh, the risk of cancer. Um, uh, from HPV. Uh, HPV is um, uh, detected in the tissue that's removed on, on staining, special staining that we do. Uh, when we biopsy a tonsil or remove a, ton uh, a cancer uh, that we suspect uh, to be pretty much all our throat cancers we test for HPV nowadays. Um, the small good news, even though it's, it's bad in that it's a rising source of cancer, the small bit of good news is that if you have an HPV-caused cancer, uh, your, your outlook is better than if it was the typical smoke-related cancer. Uh, it responds better to radiation, responds better to surgery, the treatment outcomes are better. So uh, that's the one small good, good news. The problem, though, is it's growing, and uh, it's anticipated that by um, the year 2020 it will surpass cervical cancer uh, as, HP, uh, as an HPV-related uh, cancer. Um, and cervical cancer is something like uh, 12,000 cases a year um, of that type. So uh, it's something that we're concerned with. We're seeing a lot more of it in our practice. It's something that's changed dramatically from when I started practice to now, or, or even the last five years. It, it's uh, become more and more common in the younger age population. The standard smoke-related cancer patient is in their mid-40s or 50s or 60s. Um, we're seeing my earliest, my youngest patient is 35 uh, with throat cancer um, uh, with HPV. So it's a younger age population they don't have to be a smoker at all, and uh, it's a it's a new source of cancer. People need to be vaccinated. Although the vaccination is is the the studies have been done to prevent genital warts, uh, that it's effective to prevent genital warts. But we think it will also be protective against uh, HPV sixteen, which is the throat cancer variety.